to, if we spend a trillion dollars on this, we might be able to be somewhat safe. But let me kind of summarize this, because I think this is what this is all about. This whole movement, this green movement, is about saving people, I hope, by making sure we take care of the environment. So I want to point out that in this whole ridiculous idea that we're going to spend a trillion dollars to eliminate 0.00017% at most of the, car, of the atmospheric uh, uh, content, in other words, that carbon emissions that we produce by 100% of our carbon imprint of vehicles. And I'm telling you, I can do the math for you later, but it's infinitesimal. It is negligible if we eliminate all the cars in, in the United States. That's how much impact we'll have on the overall content of the atmosphere. We're going to spend a trillion dollars. We're going to create chemicals. We're going to create fires. We're going to create hazards. If you don't care about the $17,000 per average car vehicle that the poor person has to afford, if you don't care uh, that there's going to be exposure to people who are trying to fight fires and that this is going to leach into the system, the very environment you're trying to save, chemicals that leach into the environment, chemicals that get into people's bodies trying to fight these fires. If we're talking about the environment, I really don't think we're having an honest conversation. I think that's where we need to start this. And, 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 and this idea that we're saving the, uh, the atmosphere by creating chemicals and creating hazards to people that we're trying to save is ludicrous. And with that, I yield.